Well, um, it depends on the on the specific situation. Um, I think there's a lot of uh, fear out there, and there's a lot of uh, risk avoidance, um, and um, that's usually not a good recipe for for uh, effective communications or great advertising, which is what which what we focus on. So. Um, there's much more of a push to, to a rational communication type, um, which can be very good with a, something that's a rational decision, but sometimes that's not the case. So one of the things that we're trying is, is just uh, instead of uh, campaigns or ideas that, that have tremendous expectations um, put on them, which you call maybe uh, big ideas or big campaigns, um, trying different communication devices um, against consumers or, or, or your target, um, uh, it, it, trying it in a few different ways, trying different media, trying different message types, um, taking less resources, less money, uh, and less time, and doing uh, what we call smaller ideas. Um, um, and and uh, trying to engage the consumer in many different ways, finding what works, and then f following that momentum with investment or, or further materials that build off of that particular idea. Um, we find that when, when marketers spend too much of their resources against one thing, one campaign or one multimedia campaign, there's so much expectation and so much um, an anticipation and resources go into it. If it doesn't, if it doesn't perform, uh, it, it, it's failure. And but when you uh, try more of a, you could call it a shotgun approach, but a, more of a different ways to, to get at people. Um, uh, any particular aspect of that, if it doesn't work too well, it's not seen as a failure. It's just seen as something that didn't work that well in the market. But 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 what what we find is that there are a few things that will work. And then you, you, you invest behind that moment. Okay, thank you. You're welcome.